We've got a weather bomb. Weather bomb. Weather bomb. Weather bomb. Something special happens when a storm rapidly strengthens in a short amount of time. A storm like this can have many names. Bomb cyclone, weather bomb, explosive cyclogenesis. So what exactly is a weather bomb? All it takes is a bit of energy to kickstart the process. Imagine warm air clashing with cold air to fuel the storm. If there are no roadblocks, then the storm can continue to grow and grow. The stronger the storm, the lower the pressure. To become a weather bomb, the storm's minimum pressure has to drop at least 24 millibars in 24 hours. Just like measuring temperatures in degrees, we use millibars to measure the pressure of a storm. This is represented on a weather map by isobars. The tighter packed these isobars are, the stronger the center of the storm can be. Surrounding areas can produce strong winds, potentially causing power outages and even triggering coastal storm surges. Ample amounts of moisture are usually associated with these systems as heavy rain, snow, and frozen precipitation as a result. The next time there's a weather bomb in your forecast, make sure you're prepared and stay alert to the severe conditions.